Hi guys! So, today I'm moving out of the truck and I have it parked over here in Phoenix. And I moved everything into this rental car that I got from Enterprise. And then as you saw in the title, this is gonna be my boob job vlog. Okay guys, we're back and driving now to a massage appointment. Um, my last massage before my boob job. I've got two this week because I won't be able to lay on a massage table for probably many months. And then I have my pre-op right after that and my pre-op is at three o'clock in Scottsdale, Arizona. That's where we are. So why am I getting a boob job and why am I filming it? So in this vlog, I am gonna take you guys with me to my pre-op appointment. I'm gonna tell you all about what I choose because I haven't chose the size yet and it's such a difficult decision. And then I'm also gonna take you guys to my surgery, which is tomorrow morning at 7.30 in the morning. I have to get there an hour early at 6.30 to the surgery center and then I'm gonna bring you guys with me to my, obviously not in my surgery, but as far as I can, as far as they're gonna let me bring my camera and I'm gonna do that. So I don't even know if I'm gonna post this yet, but I really wanna vlog it. So if you guys are watching this, then that means I ended up posting it. And so far, I did a lot of research all over the country. Every major city, I looked at their plastic surgeons and this guy had the most natural, beautiful breasts. I'm gonna put a couple of photos of what my goal is up here with kind of like censoring it so I don't get um, striked for nudity. So right now, if you can kind of see, I mean, you can probably see in so many, I'm wearing like two shirts because, okay. This is what I look like now. This is me now. I'm like a small B. Especially when I'm working out and I'm really lean. Right now, I think that I wanna be maybe like a full C, small D at the most. I'm probably gonna stick around C because I'm kind of skinny and lean most of the time, so I just don't want to be like a big P shape. And I also don't want like big boobs and a big butt, and I really don't like big boobs. I just like a nice full set of titty witties. <laughs> and he never really wanted me to get my boobs done, and I never thought that I would. I think she's got the perfect body, very yeah. hourglass, but it's gonna make her happier, so I support her and I'm on board. Yeah. And everyone that I've ever known never always said, no, don't get a boob job. Like, I love your natural perky boobs. And as I get older and they get less perky, You're then so I just... perky. <laughs> then I don't have as perky boobs anymore. I just have, like, small ass yitties. So... <laughs> so I'm having coffee right before my massage. That's exciting. I'll see you guys in a couple hours at my pre-op appointment. Doesn't this look Wait, like yeah. Arizona? Side and go to the second floor and we're in Scottsdale. This is the Priya. <laughs> she put some Peter Light wait face me. <laughs> Very frequently sensation returns to normal, but in some cases it may take months. Hey right, everyone. I'm done with my pre-op. It's time to get ready for surgery. Did the countdown start? Tomorrow morning. Good morning, guys. Today is the day. And this is the Airbnb and mom is here. And then babe is in the car. It's super cute in Phoenix. And I'm gonna show you my bedroom. This is where I'm gonna be recovering just for today. I've got this like cool bag thing I got. And then I have to wear a sweater that zips down. So this is what I'm wearing this surgery. And then I've got everything set up. I got my water ready next to my bed. I'm just gonna crawl back in here and I have some friends on already for me. So and then he's gonna stay here and be a good boy. Huh, Rudy? You like that bed? So this is such an upgrade from the truck. And then we have, yay. Okay, so when you guys see me next, I'm gonna be still quite sedated. 
when you guys see me next, it'll be after surgery. Surgery's at 7.30 and then it'll be around an hour and the doctor will call him after I'm done and then... Have fun, baby. Love you. Okay. A little sleepy, okay. but she did well. Okay. Hey, princess. Okay. Open your eyes, hon. She's been having a little bit of nausea. We've given her everything we can, but just in case, I have. She, she's thirsty and wants a lot of water, but I gave her a couple sips only because I, you know, again on the ride home I was worried. Okay, hon, open your eyes. Her arms should be back. Watch your head. There you go. And she doesn't have a dressing on, she just has this breastband on, and then this, these are the incisions that he used. And I wrote So for today... Until we'll... the first office visit, but I wouldn't do it to, I think starting yeah, tomorrow. Today. Planning on hoping for a Good. Scene. This is just some stuff on your face. Perfect. Okay. Well, you guys take care. Right on. Thank you so much. <laughs> okay, bye Thank bye. you. is my neck. Yeah, I think it's that angle. Let's just right. 3 out of 10. That's not bad at all. That's not bad. I don't even remember getting in the car. You weren't supposed to. <laughs> that ride was terrifying. Like every little bump was so like... I think we should do some ponytails on her to get the hair out of her neck. Because she was laying on it for hours. I just realized when I was pulling it out. To the tally, Madison Barton calling her Maddie. Yes. Like Mads try send me the addy. Hi guys, so I can't really. Um, I was checking in. I'm on my fourth day. Haven't hit a week yet, but I am wearing a bra finally because I've been free hanging for the first couple days and then I have this strap on to hold them down for a whole week. I can't raise my phone any higher because my arm, but um just watching some selling sunset on Netflix. And then um yeah just wanted to update you guys on my status. Everyone's sleeping. It's like two in the morning. My sleep schedule is crazy because I was on like some pretty strong pain meds at first and now I'm just on Valium. So I'm just relaxed and stuff and I'll be on Valium just for the next couple days and then hopefully I can get off all pain meds and medication so that I can poop. Alright guys, I'll check in with you. Probably my one week post up, which is on Monday.